All right, let's see how we do here. So we're on take two for the, the how many how many reruns on Elite Four can I go through in one go? I did not show my Unova run. I'm already, as you can see, I'm already here at the final um, leader or the rival. The reason being is um, in my previous video, I did show how to go through Unova, so I didn't want to repeat that. <clears throat> uh, I found that starting with Meta Gross has kind of given me some better results. So I'm going to try this run using Meta at the start. All right, let's get started. <clears throat> Well, you need a fire blasted. Definitely would be better if I went with a <laughs> blissy here. There's a withdrawal. Who comes out? Okay, Exadrill. What up, Liz? Bro, don't you got summer school tomorrow? You should be asleep. It's 11.50 at night. Alright. What did he use? Earthquake? Alright. We'll exit draw herself. <clears throat> at least she'll be with friends. Hello, sir. It's at Leon. I actually have a confession. And so we're coming out, we're coming out with like baby names because we're expecting the baby tomorrow or the day after. And believe it or not, like I'm only naming the kids with ELs. Like my first, my first born son's Eloy. My daughter is Elena. And believe it or not, but Elian is actually on the list for if we have a boy, I'm not even joking. So... And I told my wife, I was like, I, I had a student named Elian, and he slept in class all the time during basketball season. So, I don't know if we can do Elian. Should ask how Elian's doing since he isn't in summer school. At least I don't think he is. I don't even know what that means, but Kane's is pretty good. All right, so I already got my plus six on my Exodro, so it's pretty, it's pretty standard here. Not summer school, good for you. Can you imagine going to summer school? Not me. I never. I would never. Alright, that was easy. That was quick. It took five minutes. <clears throat> I probably could have done it quicker if I started off with the uh, Blissey or whatever. So, for a champion, you definitely want to start with the Blissey. Alright, 103, TK. Alright, cool. Next region, I'll do, uh, I'll do Sinnoh next. Dun, dun, dun. Yeah, Liz, you should definitely be asleep. You got so much in the morning. Elian, he's fine. Elian ain't got nothing. He's got vacation. That's what he's got. Actually, have you all started a summer program, Elian? I want to go high. I'm assuming you have. The tennis program, the tennis summer program already started. Yeah, you have workouts. Yeah, I figured you all had something for sure. Mm -hmm. 
let's get this started. My name isn't that bad. Work has been started for three weeks. Football starts July 8th. Yeah, I just gotta get the workouts in. Was that a scam bot? Yes, it was. Alright, so we're starting with Meta and Sinnoh. We're gonna get swapped out to the Flygon. Who knows Earthquake? <clears throat> I'm still gonna try and Stealth Rock because I don't wanna... I don't wanna risk... Dying here. I don't think I get one tapped here. I don't think so. Yeah, I didn't think so. Yeah, take those workouts serious, Elian. And honestly, I would, I would be, I would, um, I would be running at home. I, I'd be, I'd be doing sprints at home too in the evenings. A hundred percent, I would. I'd even do some in the middle of the day. Back when I was in, back when I did high school sports, I, I was doing sprints in the middle of the day as well. The doof on your team would follow. You know what, high ground. This is like an Elite Four team specific. This is specific for Elite Four reruns. Okay. Bidoof is the, our Lord and Savior. Alright, I'm at plus six. Now we have speed. This one will go by quick. <clears throat> but yeah, I would be doing sprints. I probably do like three or four gassers like in, during the day. Um, I'd be doing probably three or four sprints during the day. All you need to do is three or four. If you do three or four sprints where you're trying your absolute best, you're going to be drenched in sweat. And that's like, you're going to be fine. Yeah, that's, that should be more than enough. Um, by the way, for the video, like, I'm talking to chat here, just, just an FYI, so... The video is very straight. I mean, the this run is straightforward. I'm already at my plus six, plus two speed, so, I mean, this is just, like, rinse and repeat stuff here. So, um, One times, yeah. I remember for basketball, we had to carry a 45 pound weight and do bleachers, those bleachers there. So we'd like, we'd start on the away side since that's closest to the field house. And then we'd like circle the track, like we'd, we'd circle the top side of the track. And then we do the home side bleachers with that 45 pound weight, like the 45 pound plate. Oh man, that was a nightmare. But we we're in great shape. Our basketball team is solid. Which actually has the better IV. I mean, EV and IV, a godly Bidoof still wouldn't, it wouldn't cut it. Because these are like, these are, these are like crazy E4. So 300, 309, 265. Alright, so, which one's a 301? I'm wasting time here, so I gotta, I gotta go Vanessa said, I do. Well, thank you. Hi, Vanessa. You should be asleep as well. We both have summer school tomorrow. Meta grows. It's gonna be an earthquake. Oh, I died. It sucks. It's gonna be a swap here. Sir, buy you food? Not gonna happen. No shot. I don't buy people food that uh, go to summer school. It's my role. <clears throat> I'm really favoring using um, Exedra, by the way, because if you use Exedra, you only need to use three turns to get to plus six. And you get to plus six. When you use Chandelure, it's gonna. I only usually go to plus four. I'm not gonna go to plus six. I take six ten six turns on that. Are you hungry right now? Go make a sandwich. I got Takadia earlier for dinner. Hmm. You Snorlax? I would, but Snorlax is also not very good for this run. Snorlax is a slow Pokemon. Not a very good tank. That's why I would like Chansey for my tank. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Alright, plus six. 
And Snorlax's uh, attacks aren't very strong. Like, there's a very specific trick, trait, or path for this run. Alright, this one's gonna be quick. So far, the RNG has been generous to me. I just have to hope it continues. After this, I'll do Kanto into Johto. Or do I do Johto into Kanto? I think I do Johto. I'll do Johto into Kanto. And those would be my four. I'll do Johto because I don't have to battle the... I don't have to battle Gary in, in Johto. In Kanto, I do. And Gary kind of trolled me um, in the previous video. Speedrunning? Kinda. <clears throat> so I popped an amulet coin, which lasts for an hour. It increases how much money you earn. So, like, <clears throat> I'm trying to go through four different regions of Elite Fours, because when you re-battle Elite Fours in this game, you get, like, 100k in currency, and you get, like, 2,000 battle points. This guy was actually faster than I was. What the heck? But that's what I asked him. I miss all my students. <clears throat> I miss all of my students. Even the annoying ones. Like... Certain people who shall remain nameless. I need a burn heal. No. Oops. Wrong person right there. Even the annoying ones. Yeah, let's go. Alright, this is fighting, so 100% I'm starting with meta. I'm not going to start with Chansey. So I do have to be quick. I already finished like the Unova E4, now I'm on the Sinnoh E4. So I've gotten through almost two in 12 minutes of this amulet coin. This guy's gonna use Scald. Which is fine. I can plus six in one turn with Polyrath. He hates y'all. Shut the hell up. I love all my students. Leech Seed? The heck? This guy got tricked in the Leech Seed? That's... Nah, he's got to swap out. That's so troll. Okay. What am I going to do here? Do I go straight into the... Do I go straight into Polyrath? Or do I trick? I'm going to go straight into Polyrath. Because he's going to swap. I think he's going to swap. That's not. That's not very effective against me. Yeah, that's nothing. So I think I speed? No, I belly drum. Oh, he kept him in. I wonder why. Is he gonna use Psychic? Oh man, I may have made a mistake here. Yeah, I made a mistake. This was a mistake. So now this guy's gonna die. That was a, that was a huge mistake. I should've known better. All right, we'll do this meta. I don't want to trick it into Psy into Shock. I really don't, but yeah, it's, it's gonna swap. Right, what is this guy going to use? I think he's going to use Scald, which sucks because I need my Polyrath. Feed him tacos and he'll be your friend. That's also very true. Alright, so that guy already had a Choice Scarf. I forgot I just gave him one already. So let's revive here. Because I may need this Polyrath. Alright, we didn't waste a turn. And I'm starting to get trolled. Alright, this guy does not have a Choice Scarf. So I'm going to trick here. What is going on? What is going on with this AI? Because now I'm going to trick and get the scarf back. What the hell is going on here? I can't. It's called. Alright, now it's called locked. Okay, that's what I wanted. Alright, swap to Polyrath. I'm going to heal here. Oh my god, I'm getting trolled. Does this thing also know Psy Shock? It might, and I'm screwed if it does. Oh, it's Solar Beam. Dude, I'm getting I'm getting I'm getting absolutely punked right now. Dude. Okay, Metacham. Alright, this is fine. Whatever. Let's salvage what we can. It's gonna use a fighting move, so I'm gonna swap over to Chandelure. 
They both had choice scarfs already. Like, I haven't killed a single Pokemon. Zen headbutt. Oh my god. I'm getting, I'm getting like punked. I'm getting punked here. All right, it's gonna use psychic move. Let's try steel. Good luck. Yeah, for real, man. I need it. My run's getting ruined right now. Shouldn't be too. That shouldn't be too strong. Dang, that took off almost half my HP. Dude, sir, Cassie hasn't gotten her phone back. Good. She doesn't. She shouldn't get it back. Oh my god, I flinched. I'm like. I'm getting very annoyed with this AI. Like I was, I was. It was so smooth and now it's tough. I have a silver three count that I'm trying. I need to get to gold. This is like hell annoying. Like this attack, I can't use any of my carries with this attack. That's why. Like, it's gonna kill my Chandelure. It's gonna obviously kill my Exodro, even though it should. It's not very effective. I mean, are you playing right now or what? Actually, no. I'm gonna, this run takes an hour and I'm going to go to bed after. Should I be using Earthquake here? I probably should. It's stronger. Oh, I fucked up. There's a full restore. What does this guy have? Choice Scarf? Leftovers? I think I swap. This guy's gonna struggle out soon. Alright, around midnight EST. Damn, son. Don't be the bronze on that has fucking levitate. God, dude. I'm getting super annoyed. Do I have an X attack? I kind of want to use that. No, I don't think so. It's... Tomorrow I'm gonna. I have an appointment. In the morning, my wife has an appointment. I'm going with her. Yeah, I think. I think the AI has another full restorer. Okay, there's fucking rest. Almost baby time. It's gonna happen in two days, no matter what. That's what I think. Tomorrow, no matter what. Dude, this is like super fucking annoying. Actual. Do I have an X attack? Yes, I do. I've never actually done this where I like buff up a Metagross. But my goodness. This is actually getting annoying. I'm not going to use any more. I am going to use a revive. On Polyrath, in case we lock in Scald again. I'll hit you up tomorrow in the evening then. <clears throat> Night, buddy. <clears throat> it's like barely any damage though. It's so annoying. I've burned, I've burned so much time doing this. I don't think I'm gonna be able to get four. Unless the other ones are like perfect. Oh, that's so annoying. Just swapping back and forth. Even if I'm not making any changes, the yeah, AI would swap, and that's like really annoying. <clears throat> and I'm not even gonna bother trying to time. I'm not even gonna bother throwing an X speed because this thing is not gonna be anywhere near fast enough to keep up with the nine tails. I mean, I'm still gonna try and get kills with this Metagross, but the nine tails is gonna come out right now. Magmortar with flamethrower. Maybe I can trick. Maybe. Not right now, obviously, but. Maybe I can still salvage this with Chandelure. 
What I don't want to happen is I throw this Blissey out. And then he swaps. I don't want that to happen. Okay. Okay, good. Alright, we should be good here. We should be fine. Alright, so it's gonna keep doing Focus Blast. I'm gonna throw in Chandelure. No, it's swapped! See, this is what I mean. Like, I'm getting- I'm getting trolled. It's gonna use Zen Headbutt right now. It has a choice scarf here. Thunder Punch. And maybe it probably doesn't even have it probably doesn't even fucking have the oh, dude expert. I'm gonna have to struggle out here. It probably doesn't even have oh no I'm not. Now it's gonna do focus blast. Alright, it's gonna do focus blast. Which means I'm gonna swap over to my chandelier. I'm going to do an X speed right now. All right, it's locked or whatever. The reason I did the X speed was because if it does swap to Metachamp, I was going to kill it with Shadow Ball. Because the spikes are, or the, the Stealth Rock is going to start to deal some damage here. So it took that took us like eight to ten minutes. I don't know exactly how long, but it took way too long. But we finally got clear of it. That's like awful. I really think I'm going to cut the fourth one really short. God, that was like really messy from the AI. That was so annoying. I hate Bronzong so much. It's all Bronzong. It's all Bronzong. Anytime the AI has a Bronzong, it's just, it just, it just throws everything out of whack. Because normally Ludicolo uses Scald on my meta. And then I lock it in on with my Polyrath and I just carry like that. That's literally how this usually almost always goes. And it's probably because I started with Metagross instead of Blissey. It's probably what's going on here. I don't think this Houndoom is faster. I do think the plus four is enough. Yeah. This Nine Tails is not faster than I am. All right, finally. That was not good, but whatever. We're moving on. I'm going back to a Blissey start. All right, we've got two more. Hopefully this one's like good to go. Lucian normally doesn't give me any trouble at all. So let's see. It's going to be a swap or focus blast. Likely a swap. Into Lucaria. Okay. I take his... What's it? Focus Sash? Yeah, I take his Focus Sash. And then I get the Stealth Rock into Chandelure Hard Carry. Okay. Alright, now we swap it out. Chandelure. Go to plus four. Actually, dude, I need to I need to save some time here. I shouldn't do this, but I need to save time. So instead of taking four turns, I'm gonna take two. What? Oh my god, what is this two pump to use? I can't I guess I can't use three in a row. It's kind of annoying, but whatever. 
I mean, I guess. It's weird. I didn't know I couldn't do that, but I guess now I do. Whatever. Let's burn through this, pun intended. I'll be done with like maybe what, 27 minutes left? No, I'm not gonna. There's no way to hit four here. I'm gonna hit three, and that's it. <clears throat> yeah, there's no way I hit four with 34 minutes left. That's impossible. I think this fucker might live through this at plus four. I could be wrong. No, crit hit. Okay. Shadow sneak. Shouldn't be enough. Oh my god, a crit hit. Not enough. Oh my god. That would have just like really ruined everything. That would have like that would have that would have messed everything up. Whatever. All right, we're good. All right, we're out of here. If I can get this done by like 29, 28 minutes, maybe. Just maybe. Try this one. I never have trouble with Cynthia. Never. Cynthia's like easy, so I better not get trolled here. Okay, Rayquaza start. Nice. I don't remember her having Rayquaza last time I when I did the last video. I don't I don't even I don't even know what the hell is going on right now. What move even is that? I don't even know what V create is. What, what move is this? It's a fire type move. Okay. Oh, it's extreme speed locked. Oh, that's not what I wanted. Um, it's not what I wanted. That extreme speed's gonna kinda hurt. Okay, there's a swap. Dark Chomp. I am gonna sacrifice my Polyrath here. I'm gonna sacrifice my polyrath. Right. I mean, obviously, if I survive and I kill with ice bomb, I'm not gonna survive. That's great. Okay, uh, it's gonna use earthquake. I'm gonna use this guy because I don't want to take too long. I want to. I want to. I want to speed it up. All right, sword dance. Zinni's Earthquake. What? Is he not locked? Now he's in his Earthquake, and now I'm gonna die. Is he not locked? What is going on here? <sighs> he's in his Earthquake, so I have to swap. I'm fucking annoyed. I swapped to the wrong Pokemon. There's the Earthquake. Um, I have the trick, okay. Oh man, this is getting annoying as fuck. I can't use my Exedra anymore, because he's the Balloon Pop. I guess I'd be cool at three, but like, four is not gonna happen on this run. So I'll do the three, and then on the fourth, I'll wait to the end to populate the next amulet coin and try Unova. I have not Unova. Hoenn. Hoenn's AI gives me, like, the worst trouble. So I'll try Hoenn and then go into a Jimmy run. But this one's done. Bag, 
like speed. Let's go. Alright, we're done. I had two battles where the AI just hard trolled me. Took an extra like 10 minutes. And then probably, I probably lost like 15 to 20 minutes of time, which maybe would have been enough for a fourth one. 20 minutes, maybe. Yeah, 29 minutes, I'll for sure finish uh, Kanto, but Johto, maybe I just go Johto, since it's technically shorter. Kanto is 4 plus rival. I'll do Johto. I usually don't have trouble with Kanto, and I have trouble with Johto, but we'll, we'll try. Because I've gotten trolled by Gary so, a few times, and I've, I've gotten trolled by Gary before. I've gotten trolled by Johto, and I always get trolled by Owen. Always. Never fails. Not where I wanted to go, man. I do need balloons, though. Good on revives, I'm good on potions, I'm good on next speeds. Actually, dude, I'm not gonna do this because I'm not, I don't have the fucking, I don't have the, the strings on this map, on this one. I'm not gonna do that. I'm wasting so much time, I hate it. Like, there's no way I'm going through that with, without strings. Not gonna happen, whatever. I'll do this. I'm pretty sure I'll get this some like pretty easy. Oh no, not a bronze song. No. <laughs> Please, not like this. Has a life orb, I think. An expert belt. Flame orb, okay. I'm gonna get one tapped here. Now we swap. <clears throat> Dude, fuck it. I'm gonna go into Chandelure without using Stealth Rock. I don't want to lose another. That's why. I don't want to lose that. I don't want to lose a meta. Like, to a potential crit hit or something. I don't, I don't want...
So this is what I'm going to do. I'm going to use next defend in the event that I'm going to X speed and then X defend in the event where like I get hit because of a, a band or something. Let me go X speed. Yeah, and then we'll, then we play it out. Let's go. Because obviously if they have a band, they're going to survive the one HP and they're going to hit me with something. I don't think Dragonite carries bands, though. It does have multi-skill, though. I lived. Which is why that fucker survived, or took so much damage in the beginning. This guy probably has one, too. Focus band, here it comes. Yep. God, I hate it. I'm so fucking annoyed, dude. I'm like so, so annoyed because I, I should have just did it and I didn't. And now I'm locked into Thunder Punch. This guy's gonna use Earthquake or Earth Power, so I'm gonna swap real quick. My faster than this guy better be. I'm not. Oh, but it's locked. I can't believe I'm not faster than that Nido King. All right, Slapperus gonna scald. Let's throw in meta. Oh, waterfall. Okay, whatever. Let's trick it. Trick. I could technically thunder punch it, but. Chesto berry for rest. I'm faster than Bronzong, so I don't need an X speed. I'm just gonna belly drum. I probably don't even need a belly drum if I'm gonna be honest. I don't need to, so I'm not going to. Um, it's still gonna take two turns anyway, but whatever. Oh, actually, I should have, I should have belly drummed because I can't, I can't earthquake this guy. I can't earthquake him. Um, so I'm annoyed. And he's got, he's gonna side shock me. Okay, no, he's not weirdo. <clears throat> Fucking weirdo. I'm gonna be at this all day, dude. Actually, I can extra drill, and extra drill will. Why am I getting punked? Am I getting punked here? I'm getting punked. Why isn't this guy using the Psy Shock? What's going on here? I'm gonna use extra I'm gonna use Exa to break the mold and then I can use Earthquake. Fucking weirdo. That's like longer than I really was hoping for. I think I have one antidote left. I hate, I hate Bronzong so much. I'm already giving, I've given up on four. I'm not even, I'm, that's not going to happen. So I just want to make sure I get three done, like, with ease. Can't get poisoned again. I'm not throwing in Blissey against Brock because. Or Bruno, because Bruno's just going to one tap my Blissey with anything he has. This guy's going to use Earthquake. Into Steelix? Salamence with Fire Blast. Just fine with me. I just want to survive with the Stealth Rock. I really want to survive this. Nice. Alright, this should be nice and smooth. 
If I have like 10 minutes left, I'll do two of the battles in Unova. So I at least get something out of it instead of just doing it on an E4 run. Good song. All right, done. Next one, moving on. None of the Pokemon died. Great. Mm, mine at least. Mm -mm. No shot, this guy's faster than I am. Easy. Okay, three, two, one, let's jam. We're good there. Smooth. Easy Bruno run, start with Metagross. Simple. Switch over to Blissey here. The Umbreon in this battle is the one that fucks me over. Agatha's Umbreon. I can lock this guy to a ground move with Bone Club. Yeah, because he's gonna use the bone club. Earthquake. Okay. Well, that's fine. Barely did any damage. Stealth Rock. Don't crit me, please. I'll use Exadrill. We'll start with the speed. Alright. Pretty smooth Agatha. It looks like it's going to be pretty smooth. So really what my goal is right now is to finish this E4. And then go to Unova and battle... The two storyline bosses, the rebattles, Cynthia and I forgot the Morimoto. I should have enough time for that because I beat them pretty quick. And I use the same team, I use this team. Is not fast on my own. Man, I'm ready for bed. I just finally had some time. So I was like, let me just try and see how I can do on this run. That was much easier than I thought it would be. 
Starting with Blissey, definitely the play. And there was no Umbreon here either. So I guess I just got it wrong and they used something different. <clears throat> I'm not crazy, right? There's no Gary and Johto. Pretty sure I'm not crazy. I should have more than enough time to get those other two battles, which is cool. And then the other ones... Because there's like a there's a path, like a retrain or rebattle path. And there's like two that give you... The old guy, the old people give you like 8, 7, 8k pop. So I'll just get some value out of this. Okay, what's he gonna do? I don't think I can listen to Bad Bunny on stream. I don't think I can. A crit hit drain punch. What do you know? It must be nice to get these crit hits. I should not have died. I should have been able to use Stealth Rock and I'm very annoyed because this AI might swap now. There it is. Because of a fucking lucky crit hit. I'm gonna sacrifice Polyrath. That's what I'm gonna do instead of taking a hit here. Because I'm locked, I can't do anything, so. So I'm gonna sacrifice this guy. I mean, if I kill it, cool. I'm still gonna try and kill it. Okay, missed. If I freeze him, that'd be great. Yeah, it was a multi scale, I think. So that's why I didn't take that much damage the first time. I don't really have anything good against this guy. And he's gonna hurricane, so. Maybe I can get away with Thunder Punch here, but I really want to lock him. Okay, good thing I didn't Thunder Punch. All right, I just took a, I swapped choice scarfs. That's essentially what I did here. So I need to know what this fucker's gonna do here. Drain punch. All right, so Shan's coming out. Chandelure comes out. And hopefully there's no swap here and I'm good to go. Twelve minutes. Waterfall. Aqua Jet. For alligators, Aqua Jet. I may lose. That may happen. Why did I stealth rock? Why did why why did why is it different for both of them? Why is this meta's trick at the top? And the other ones isn't. And now it's only going to use like, oh my god, I'm so mad. This is so annoying. Crit hit. Oh, oh my god. I am so annoyed. A fucking crit hit, dude. I need to survive this hit. When I should, because he doesn't have the choice orb anymore. Revive the Polyrath. Hopefully, with Waterfall locked, I win the game. Yeah, okay. A Godberry kicks in after I belly drum. No, it doesn't, but it's fine. He's gonna waterfall again. Okay, yeah, dude. Oh, so annoying. But it's over, so whatever. I, I killed the Charizard because Charizard's gonna take Stealth Rock again, so I'm gonna kill the Charizard just fine. Alright, we're gonna Drain Punch because we wanna go to max HP. And this bitch is gonna die, and I should have enough time to do at least those two battles I wanna do. 
and get a good like 13 14k out of it this guy's gonna want to use hurricane but he's not faster than i am and stealth rock kills okay i like the veer gets an earthquake and dies Lucario gets an earthquake and dies. It's funny because Lucario is like what steel fighting and is weak to fighting. Strange. <clears throat> Scrafty gets an earthquake and dies. Alright. We have more than I think nine minutes is more than enough time. It should be. To do both. Because Morimoto doesn't take very long. There's another one. Oh my god, I did not think that there was going to be another. Gary's in both? Gary's in both. No, I'm in Kanto. I'm not in Johto. I'm in Kanto. Oh, of course Gary's here. I have nine minutes to be Gary. I'm such an idiot. When do I have, I have enough? Alright. Trick. Busy swap to Arcanine. Close combat Arcanine. I don't know if I'll have enough time to do both now that I think about it. Alright. Mm, stealth Rock. Close combat, Stealth Rock. Chandelure carries the game. That's my that's what I hope for. I hope Gary doesn't troll me with the swaps. Which Gary is notorious. Four. Don't be a cuck. All right, thank you. All right, this one's done. I'll maybe have like, what, four or five minutes left? Which is cutting it close. The good news is like, with this, like I beat Morimoto pretty quickly with this strat. Same thing with Cynthia. Cause Cynthia's aren't even level 100s. So, neither are Morimoto's. I want to just go to plus four, hit the speed, and win the game. Better not get aqua jetted or something. And so I barely made three. It's crazy. But the AI, there was at least one AI in, in the final two runs that just fucking trolled me. I think the last region in Sinnoh two, two trolled me, which is strange because Sinnoh is usually extremely simple and easy. And all the in all my Sinnoh runs, it goes by quick, like less like fifteen minutes. All right, this is done. We'll be at about four minutes. And I actually loathe doing Hoenn. Hoenn has great music, but man, do I get trolled. Alright, maybe I'll be at 5 minutes, because I'm at 6.20 right now, so I think I should be at 5 minutes. <clears throat> Alright, yada yada yada. Should be 5 minutes soon. Yeah, 5 minutes and... There's 5. If I can get these two within this amulet coin, I would, I'll be very happy with that. I'll be very happy if I get both.
Swap. I take his focus sash. I live with one HP. E close combats or cross chops. I should be good. Oh, wait, we swapped choice scarves. I'm getting trolled. <clears throat> Whatever. Still did the same since I didn't die. Because he doesn't have level 100s. It's level 85. Like, that's... I don't think I need to do plus 4. I think I can do plus 3 here since they're level 80s. And I should be fine. Should we have two minutes left? It's cutting it close, we'll see. Cutting it real close. I probably only needed to do plus two, to be honest. Not have been alright. I don't think I'm going to be able to pull it off. Two forty, probably two fifty, two fifty-five. I don't think I'm gonna be able to do it. I don't think I beat her in two in a minute and a half. Is the travel time too? Twenty-four k. It's not bad. I don't think so, man. We're gonna try. Two minutes and four seconds. Let's see. Level 90, maybe we can get away with plus 2, plus 2. I think I can get away with this too. Pokemon left, 35 seconds. I have to kill, I have to one tap this guy. 20 seconds. I don't think I'd do it. I'm short on time. God damn. So close, man.
I literally needed like 20 seconds, 30 seconds. 20 seconds would have been enough. But I got trolled so much on that last E4 run. So close. Like 20, 20 seconds is what I needed. Okay, so we successfully got the three plus Morimoto. Man, it's just... <clears throat> I gotta be better. I mean, that's really all it comes down to. It's gotta, it's gotta be better with the, uh, what do you call it? I'm gonna call it for the evening, which is why I'm not, I'm, I'm gonna just do these right now. And, Cause why not? Cause it's already, it's 12.49 in the morning, so I need to go to sleep. I took a good nap today, a good like two hour nap, but not a big appointment in the morning. So I like I stand by it. If I have good RNG, I can squeeze four a hundred percent. But both Sino and Kanto gave me just so much trouble. More than they ever usually do. Like Kanto gives me trouble. Like if you watch in my Kanto rerun, if you watch the the E4 rerun I did last time. I can't tell gives me issues, but Sino usually doesn't. It's kind of annoying. What are these gonna give me? Like 5k, 6k, 7k? I'm not gonna pop a hand coin for these, there's no way. So if they give me like 5 or 6k, then whatever. It helps out with potions and that nonsense, but. Anyways, so this was. A bit smoother than my last one, I guess. I'm just thinking of five, six. That's fine. But I'm going to keep trying. I'm going to keep trying until I eventually get it. And I will. Like, it, it is possible. And then, like, my Blissey isn't, like, technically perfect. It's EV perfect, but not IV. Well, yeah, it's not IV perfect. Defense and special defense are not at 31, and its attack is 31, so... I could technically have a better Blissey. The problem is I'd have to buy the Chanseys. Because there's no way I'm spending that much time catching, like, looking for Chanseys and catching them. So, I mean, I'd have to go through the breeding process of getting, like, the absolute perfect one. One of my metas isn't perfect either. But I don't think the problems with the Metagross. I think the problems with the Blissey. Like 31 HP is good. 31 speed is not important. It needs 31 special defense, 31 defense, and it's at 25, 28, 28, 25 respectively. So. So tomorrow during the day, I try again. Alright, so I'm obviously going to do Unova first tomorrow, so we'll be there and be ready. I mean, we got like a little, we got about 400k. So it's whatever. We did, we got 400k out of that. I think I have one more amulet coin. Yeah. I need berries. Okay, let me get... How many X speeds do I have? Three. Actually, let me just fucking get... Me, um, X Defend, uh, X Special. Revives. Potions. I need 352. So after restocking items, I'm back to, I made 226k that run, which is not very good. But I'm technically prepping for the next run, so it's a 400k run. Return of okay. So I'm going to stop it here.
all right um got three again i'm fine with that that's not i mean i'm not too upset about it i still need to do like technically i need to do a gym rerun and that gives me a couple hundred a couple more 100k but if you had any questions, feel free to leave them in the comment section. I do thank you for tuning in. I thank you for your time. As always, if you have any questions or any, if you have any additions or concerns or anything you want to tell me, put it in the comment section. I will see it. You guys have a good night and good luck with your reruns. Appreciate it.